There we go. Now we're back. Hello, YouTube. We're back, and we're in a different city doing the same thing. Yeah. I go crazy if it don't work out. I found out. So, it's good to have some kind of physical exercise in your life. I pay 30 bucks a month to go to Quick Fitness 24-7, and that is working out pretty well. It's usually empty, and it has a lot of equipment. It's pretty great. Like, I kind of don't want to get a National Fitness membership, just because this place is so quiet. How'd I know? Let's throw a air purifier in the middle of this place because it's going to be too close to that trash burner. Fire department, not a landing strip fire department. A bit overkill. What games you playing, AJ? Hmm. What you got going in your life? You get satisfactory yet? Gosh, stop complaining, game. Jeez. Give me a break. Let's just pause. The complaints stop if I just pause. Apparently this is really junky. Wow. How many hours did that take? Because Marathon, is that the longest, or is, no, the longest is like Epic or something, right? And Deity is the highest level. What is there to grind in RuneScape? Just leveling up all the time? I don't know. I could only play a marathon game with computers because with people, it would take so long. All right, that looks good enough to me. Let's get water. Does it actually take that long to reach that kind of level or is it a uh... You just like lollygagging around RuneScape. Instantly we have giant polluting awfulness. Okay. Gone. Nope. 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 Tell me what that is. 
Like, if your goal is to get, do raiding, would it take you this time? I gotcha. Uh, nothing. Wow, you can't raid to your max level, and you've gone through all of the five player dungeons. Then you can do raiding. It's not easy mode like RuneScape. Duh. I gotcha. So is RuneScape like money driven or is the, a lot of the gear obtained just from doing dungeons and like quest rewards? I don't remember enough about RuneScape. Cause all I cared about RuneScape was making a lot of money. That's all I did. Not enough parks. There we go. We finally did it, I think. Why are these abandoning? just interesting to see that you can like okay so like the best gear you can't buy because at least in old way you couldn't buy your way into you might be able to buy your way into like low level group dungeon gear but you could not do raiding your raiding gear is only earned through doing that through doing those small dungeons unless you had a really nice guild and they just like boosted you the whole way. Why are these abandoning? This landfill's too close. Can we put trees in? Will trees make you a happy game? So some happy trees, you know. Freaking Bob Ross in it in here. Pro tier Bob Ross plays. You can buy gear, but you can't all of these like good gear, PvP or PvE, either one, you can't buy. Because you can only craft up to a certain tier and everything is bind on pickup, usually. It's like whoever loots that epic swords just has that sword forever. Can't sell. And they might have changed that with newer WoW, they probably did. At least Lich King and earlier, there's very, very little high-level gear. What you could buy, though, is you could buy gems and enchantments and, uh, like, all the accessories to this gear. And also, you have to pay for your repairs, armor repairs of the raiding. So what I would do is I would raid for probably four hours every night and then... During the day when we're not raiding, I would probably spend two or three hours just making money to pay for repairs, buy up any new gems that I need, and buy uh, potions and food and whatnot. It's like a, a treadmill of just throwing money in a hole in the ground. Pretty good stuff, right? It was fun, though.
That's the that's the WoW I hope to recapture with Classic WoW. That's for sure. It's not like they made money irrelevant, but... Alright, let's save them. There we go. Well, this will just turn out however it freaking turns out. I'm tired of messing with it. A lot of high tech over here. So in RuneScape, can you do like quests up to the level that you would do dungeons and then with the dungeons carry you on to raids? Or is it just like actually grinding by going in the woods and killing boars for 10 hours? every day for two weeks then one day you hit the magic level I got you. So is that any actual grind? Okay, just here, here, there. Okay, and that's equivalent to wow, back in the day though. I don't know. I don't think you ha had to grind. You may have to go hop to different areas to get enough quests to make to meet the levels. That is the nice thing about RuneScape is it's an MMO that can truly do anything. I gotcha. A lot of people when they say grinding now, they talk about like just repetitive questing. I'm like, no, that's not grinding. Real grinding's the freaking. Well, I'm at a quest and I need to go up two more levels, and it's gonna take three days, and so you just kill crap for three days. Maybe dungeon grinding, if you had to do the same dungeon like 20, 30 times to get that one piece of gear, but. Not this modern whiny baby. Oh no, I had to do quests. What a grind. Get that crap out of here. Hey, chopping down trees is a ne necessary skill. Okay. You know what would be perfect is if we ran this road. Alright. There. Boom. How long have we been streaming? Almost time to change over. So another episode of SimCity 4 on YouTube. Pause. Oh no. Hey, 
AJ, you been playing Monster Hunter at all? I got to do the Kolbe Teroth fight with Nick, and that was really cool. Danger. Power plants over capacity. Hi, Tech. I have gotten pretty a lot better good. I mean, the first time I did Kolbe Teroth, I, I think I died maybe once. Did I die? I don't remember. I don't think I died, actually. And I've been getting, uh, I'm like halfway to my high tier 8 or whatever dual blades not as good as Nick not even close but I'm getting there I only play like once a week maybe less recently I've been so busy covered now Nick is Nick is up there he's way up there he's also a human encyclopedia of monster hunter I think he he almost soloed freaking what is it behemoth or whatever it is from the Final Fantasy stuff, he's... What is this? Maybe he did actually do that, I don't know. So power plant's gonna explode, and I have to find it. And blow it up. Oh, it's this one. Frame rate's so low in this game, it's so hard to run. I mean, last time you and me played was, what, a month, two months ago, at least? And it keeps playing that game. The Nick I know will play Monster Hunter until he beats every bit of content by himself. All of it. The whole game. Every Monster Hunter. So eventually he'll just like beat all the content, but they keep releasing more and more content for this one. I'm not getting burnt out. I don't know. Oh, yep. Well, this episode of... What is this? Sim 54? Episode number 55, I think, is over. Come back next time. We can do more of the same thing. Actually, we'll work on the big city.